right, guys, we have a 10 minute AMRAP for quality to start today. You're gonna be doing 10 hollow rocks, 10 side plank dips, and then 10 suitcase deadlifts or tipping birds. Um, you'll do 10 per side on the side planks and then five per side or 10 total on the suitcase deadlifts or tipping birds. Then our workout portion, we're gonna be working for a minute and a half, resting for a minute and a half for six total intervals. You're gonna start with 50 double unders or a different jump rope movement and then 25 jumping jacks. And then follow it up with whatever time is left with wall walk. So if the double under jumping jack portion takes me 30 seconds, then I'll have a minute for wall walks. If it takes me a minute to do this first part, I'll have 30 seconds for wall walks. Okay, let's go over all those movements. 10 minute AMRAP to start, hollow rocks. I'm gonna come down onto my backside and I want this movement to be nice and smooth. So I can just start here, tucking my knees in towards my chest and if that's easy, I'll start to lengthen out. Just finding that nice smooth rock, taking away that arch in my low back by compressing ribs to hips. That's movement one. Next, I've got a side plank dip. I can do this from my palm or my elbow. I'm gonna dip my hips to the ground and then press back up. Again, I can do that from my elbow as well. Hips down and then lifting back up. You'll feel your obliques working a lot there. You're gonna do 10 of those per side. Next is our suitcase deadlift. So I'm gonna have a bell or a uh, dumbbell or kettlebell, some kind of weight in, each, in one hand. I'm gonna hinge, tap the ground, and then stand back up. If going all the way to the floor isn't comfortable, I'll just go as low as I feel good. I'm gonna do five on the right arm and then five on the left, just trying to keep myself as neutral as possible, even though I'm unilaterally loaded. If I don't have a weight, I'm going to balance on one foot, push my hips back, reach that hand for the ground, trying to work on nice balance here, trying to keep my body as long as possible, making myself into a T rather than an umbrella. That is part one. Part two, I'm gonna be working through double under. So having a jump rope in hand, I'm gonna jump and try to spin that rope under my feet two times. I can also work on penguin pats if I don't have a jump rope, or I can just go straight to jumping jacks instead. After I finish that work, I'm gonna to come to a wall, bring my feet into the, into the base of the wall, down to my belly, I'll press up walk myself into a partial handstand. And then I'm gonna get as close to the wall as I feel comfortable before walking back down. If going just to that 45 degree angle is as high as you wanna go here, then that can be my wall walk today before walking back down and repeating. Uh, the goal as you work through that is to keep ourselves in that tight hollow body, not letting our hips relax into the wall. Have fun with it.